Heads towards Edmonds. Couldn't gather. G could. She stripped. Egan. Conti. She's got some support. This is Wakefield. Stands tall in one tackle. Still got the football. G takes her down. And Georgia G, there is not much of her at just 160 centimetres, but she throws her body, her complete body, into every tackle. She's 50. If it might have been taken high. Here's G. Pokes it into space. The blue speedsters are over the back again. This Traffic cleavers oh. Van Dyke off to G. She's a classy user and hits up Harris with a peach. One. So she's playing with house money. G. Brazali. Now a chance for the Blues to attack off halfback. Here's the speedy G. Can kick out into space. McAvoy led beautifully. And G oh, found her. In front of those stoppages tonight. Loins was stopped. Conti spun handball. Jarks poke from Dalton. G's clean. Press Parkers normally a finisher. Delegates it off. And strolling in goes Walker. The Blues had a famed mosquito fleet in the late 70s and early 80s. They've got a new version in their forward half this season. Buzzing around, Walker, Dalton, G, Presparkis, McAvoy. Brennan couldn't take it. Down he comes the other way. Swooping in was G. Kick Press tonight for the Blues. Shoveling it was Presparkis. G can find some space and has support in the form of Pound. Around the body, Vessio, those sticky hands. Good defense from Sansonetti. Some promising signs, just little nuggets here and there. So it's gone on, the more dominant she's become. G comes in and lays a tackle. No so busy, Georgia G. Another one of these young blues. They're hoping to have a breakout year. Here's Conti. Handball smothered by Brazali, who's taken down, couldn't get boot to ball. Conti will go again, slips away from Egan. Can't get away from G. She is so quick. Thank you. Hold, please. Fourth generation footballer, Georgia Hold G. It. Still a chance to go get it. G. Presparkis off a step. Bends it across her body, but. They're in headlights. It's their first, you know, open AFLW. Off to Moody, who can thump it long. Doesn't make good contact on this occasion. It'll work for G. She gathers at 50. He's all in at every contest. G. Quick hands. It's towards Porter. Walker gets rid of Porter. Opens the door here for G. She. Here's G. Downey against Leighton. G slaps it out in the Press Barkers direction. In a spirited contest. lalawifi has got a couple of numbers. She finds G. Little handball. Ground to, to try and help. Still just three touches for Vessio and two for Stevens. Here's G looking to get involved. Goes towards a few of the one on one. So brilliant game from her. Press Barkers, the quick release. Ricochets inside 50 again. Livingston's first to attack the ball. Oh, she almost brought it down. Egan. Started like a house on fire. Smothered off her boot. Great defensive work. Kiyochi. Butler goes in to win the football. It's been really, really strong. Uh, Livingston's had a remarkable game. Talking at quarter time about she'd been a bit quiet. It was almost scary that she was still still there for Collingwood. Given In their half so far, the Blues. Moody's kick scrubby. Gets over a set of hands. Harris, clever. Works it for it. Just needs to sit here for G. On the third bite, she'll get it. Stroll in. Blues with the opener. <laughs> Chelsea Randall, fourth inside 50. Finally, the Blues was starting to show for it. Yeah, they worked hard just in that first couple of minutes there and Taylor just a lovely little smart little tap forward there just to get that footy forward and uh, Georgia G with that goal there. So Lamb, careful to come off the line. They try and work it into this tricky breeze. Well done G, the goal kicker so far. Press Parker, she's been busy. Back to Harrington who did a couple of steps in reverse. G on the half volley, back to Harrington. Gathering his plane. She elects to snap it around her body for territory. She was dealt with as she kicks, so the free kick will pay its way forward for the Blues here. Georgia G kicked the opening goal of the game. She got Vessio on. It's going to hang in the breeze. Darcy got the hands to it. Else will send them inside 50. The ball a little ill-directed. I think it was G she was after. Brown in on the footy. Of the ground and plane under pressure from Lamb will still get a boot to it. Stevens used her hands well in the body work. Ferris, a hand pass to no one. Well, in the end, she's hand passed it to G, and G slotted the goal. That's her second for the day. And as we see this again, really smart, just intercepts that ball. 
had another defender in front of her and decided, I'm going to do the ground ball and get this ball past her. And uh, it was a very smart call. That into something more. Gives it off to Ferris. Tackled immediately by G. And it's almost like they've swapped jumpers. They've Got hands to it. Out into space. Dathis on Brazali. Well gloved there by Vessio. Sends the kick wide. Oh, shocking bounce for the Dogs in defence. G gathers, looking for a third or maybe an option to hand off Loin. She might just about score a try here. Brown, pressure on the Dogs. Ferris stripped. Harris trying to keep it alive. Who's here? Walker, maybe one last option. Kicks. Harris denied. He's just sat on this and then realised they got it out. He is on the deck. Running on tied legs, Gamble. Horrible bounce for all concerned. Loin's involved. And she picked this ball up. Huntington over the top of her as well. Almost a professional free. Dora Jar here for G. Has a bounce. Steadies. Chips. Stevens. Chelsea Rounder, what a tough kick from there. Nick Stevens' first goal since round two, 2018 against. With the ball the deck and then wins it at ground level. Hand pass off to Prasparkis. Pokes it over the top. There's a couple to choose from. And G has her third for the afternoon. Well, Manny Prasparkas, a well-weighted kick. Knew she had numbers over the, the flight of the footy there. And a lovely little block. Gained some extra time and finished off strongly. Georgia G is going to remember the third <laughs> AFLW Pride game. She came here this afternoon with two career goals. She's kicked three. Towards the wing, again in the Phillips direction. Plenty of numbers at the fall of the ball. Georgia G kicked three goals last week. Skink back to Prasparkas. Had a bit of the ball, just hasn't quite been as effective as usual yet. G, that's a clever kick. Egan worked in the space, took the mark. The kick from Dalton was offhand, so it was a throw in instead. So it worked the one two with playing great chase mules. Just did enough. G, Dalton, back to G. For Hosking, who has a bit of time and space, goes to G. We know she's creative. Doesn't kick it into the. G. Umpires put the whistle away. Just this brick wall for the Saints forwards to try and get through. She's so consistent down there and back. G read it well. Takes the mark. Chips it down the line. Finds Edwards. It's to take them on and does. Exciting from Chloe Dalton. She'll keep running. Down he gets run down from behind by Guttridge. Here's the creative G again. He's inside 50. Front and centre was G. Well read as well there by Lucas Rod. Mark. Kelly at ground level scraps for the Saints. G wraps her up. Out of defence. An awkward one here. A spillage might work Carlton's way. G into the path of Walker. And she'll get a free kick. She was pushed in the back after she got rid of it. But G, Walker and Dalton are really developing a, a bit of a sixth sense between the three of them, aren't they? Well, tried to step around Walker. Puts it into the path of Priest. G takes her down from behind. Through the legs of Egan. But Dalton stayed in support. It was really important play from Dalton. Now G. She can run and go, can look for McAvoy who turns. Beautiful understanding from G and McAvoy. Great support run there from Dalton was critical and then great understanding between G and McAvoy. They've got so many elite runners in this Carlton outfit. Saints have the football. Johnson flips it up to Vesely. She was affected by the pressure. Harris did well, slapped it down from the back. Bends a kick back towards the goal square. Stevens tracking back, will it sit? She's got Brown for company. Tries to turn her onto the left foot. Handball back into a dangerous spot. G collects, snaps, and goals! This time it's the Blues with the quick response. And the margin back out to 24 points. Take a bow, Georgia G. Nicola Stevens did brilliant just to keep it in play. And she just has the capabilities of popping up at the perfect moment and doing uncanny things. So Georgia G kicks her first, her fourth goal of the year. Having a fantastic season for the Blues. She'll chip it short. Carlton, the number one kick efficiency team in the competition. They do use it so well. This is Georgia G. G, who's kicked four goals straight for the season. Goes towards Harris. Here, Melbourne been controlling the football and controlling the territory. Over the back is Downey. Blues have got some numbers again. The clock up with Lalawifi can float a handball over the top. G links up with Loins. Hands of Pierce. 
through the legs of Moody. Here's Harris, can link up with G. She's a classy finisher, bends it goalward. It's bouncing to the line. Chance here for Walker and the Blues respond. And the ideal response, they say speed kills abs, <laughs> certainly does in the front half of the Blues. Second touch, needs to get busy for the Blues. Matty Gay tries to squeeze it down the line, but Depp gave herself some space. Hosking pokes it forward. It's a two on one. Make it a three on one. The Blues have got ground level. Harris versus Cordner. Slick hands to G. Great team football from the Blues. And they get their second. So she was assisted off the ground and beautiful kick there by Nick Stevens. And Taylor Harris just did enough to keep that footy in front of her and then quick hands out the back to, to Georgia G, who finished truly. Her player and attacked it. Got it to Hanks. She's taken down, and you're right, Abs. The pressure from the Blues. Pound. Punches it to 50. Emmonson at the back against G, who gets there first. Feeds a handball to Hosking, a slight fumble. And here's all their speedsters getting involved. Walker kicks towards Harris at half forward. Cordner at the back. Georgia G lurking to run her down. Perfect tackle. Timed it beautifully. And the Blues can go inside 50 once again. G kicks to a dangerous spot. Bounces to the middle of the ground. Presparkus and G. Little toe poke from G in the Presparkus direction. Somehow kept her feet long enough to win the football. It's half time. Can the D's respond? Pierce is going to get run down. Great tackle, Georgia G. Not rewarded. Umpire says play on. Little hand in there, knocks it forward. Blues have got some numbers. Danger here for the D's. It's arrived. Zanka, Egan, under pressure from Pierce. And again, the Blues will get it out over the back. G the receive. The opening term for all their dominance, Brisbane. Only a two point lead with the slight breeze. Dwyer goes to ground. Edwards, Dalton, G tied against the line. Chris Barkas had to wait on Harrington's kick, fit it to Downey. Now Hosking and Hosking to G. Goes back with the flight, takes the mark. She's got Walker down the line. Harris as well. She's got Bessio leading at 50. Goes in the Harris direction in the end. Well, it's spilled over the back to Vessio without anyone touching it. And she just kicks for territory here. The speeds to G against Campbell. Campbell's got the body size and the strength and the gather. But G will stay with her. <laughs> she didn't have the speed. And G ran her down. Oh, Georgia G, I tell you what, I certainly don't want to take her on. Have a look at this closing. And it'll be speed. 50 again because Brisbane have run through the mark in their effort to get back and pick up the Carlton players who had streamed forward. Katie Loins, which is where the kick went, was out on her own, and I think it might have been Kathy Spark, spotted it, went sprinting off to try and shut Loins down, but in the process, just runs straight through the protected zone. There you go, just on screen there. So a chance for the Blues to get one into the breeze in this third term and open up a little bit of a buffer in this contest. G directly in front. Hasn't missed this season. She's got six straight, and the Blues lead by 13 points. That'll be another free kick. Umpire says play on advantage. G lurks at the back, can tidy up and kick a second. Well, it was a long bomb in from Taylor Harris out here from Loins. That was a sling tackle, but play on to advantage. She got it over the back to Georgia G, and that's the position that defenders don't want Georgia G in because she's so quick. But now she's got runners to the outside. She's got McAvoy on the inside, or she can deliver to G. She chooses the third option. G now versus Campbell at ground level. Harris in support, gets the hands free. It's picked off by Webb. Webb handballs down the line, will go herself. Couldn't quite hit the kick, and then in Keefe. McAvoy at ground level, can't get clear. G smothers it off the boot of Lutkins, who then gets rid of G. G gets the football back, goes Conway, confronted by Loins, so handballs out in front, then she's run down by G, and in the end kicks it out on the full. Good pressure there by Georgia G. She was an absolute live wire in that third term. Numbers, McAvoy with strength, manages to chip it through. G's going to get her third! Back in control at 22 points, Abs. Brisbane have only got one speed from here. They've just got to go full throttle. Absolutely, they do. You would think that this third goal from Georgia G, that could potentially be it. That... Manages to slip away from Spark. 
with the outside of the right boot in the G direction. Manages to keep her feet. She's so clean with ball in hand. That physical pressure in the second half, and the Blues have been able to find a bit of space. And that she appears in. Eight of those contested. She does the hard stuff. Here's G with speed towards the pocket. Stevens is presented all afternoon and delivers it low inside 50. Harris at the front. Might have been a falcon. It spills to G. Off to McAvoy. Flying shot at goal is good. And the Blues will get a late one. It was a falcon to Harris. The handball out from Georgia G. 